What's up everybody, Rick Devin here, Holy Moly Outdoors. Thank you so much for joining us tonight. We are talking pink salmon off the beach for Tech Tip Tuesday, so stay tuned. All right guys, so like I said, we are talking pink salmon off the beach. Honestly, one of my favorite things to do in just all aspects of fishing is beach fishing in the fall, late summertime. It's where we're at right now. We're, we're approaching August. We're starting to see that first push of pinks coming into the sound. Guys in the boats are catching them. It is go time for you beach guys. And let me tell you, the most simple and effective way to catch these off the beach is with this rig right here. If you haven't heard of it, this is a buzz bomb. And a buzz bomb is a really cool lure. Free sliding on your line, you can see there. It is a lead lure ounce and a half, two ounces, cast like a dream, and you fish it as you jig. So you cast it way out, and as you retrieve it, you jig it up, and then it flutters back down. And you jig it up, flutters back down. Fish can't say no, and they absolutely slam it. One of the most effective lures for a beach fisherman. Well, while that is true, there are ways to help add just a little more pizzazz and make you different and set it apart. And that is adding a little hoochie skirt to your bait. You can see here, I got color contrast, purple, white, green, and added that pink skirt really makes this thing pop. It's UV, everything's included that you need to really be successful. So a quick breakdown of, of fishing this, right? And why this is so successful for you guys right now. Because a searching lure like a buzz bomb gives you the ability as a shore fisherman to reach those jumping fish. You can fish it effectively, cover a ton of water, and really you're set up for success. The basic rigging, as I mentioned already, is straightforward. So you, have your main line coming down. It goes through the center of the buzz bomb. There is an arrow directions for the fat end for the line to go down and the skinny end at the bottom for the line to come out. It comes with a little rubber bumper stop bead to help protect your knot and then you tie on your hook. Now what I like to do, and you guys have seen this potentially in some of my other videos, I run a quality barrel swivel and a nice side wash hook. This is a must add one knot, but that little swivel helps to keep your fish and helps on success for landing ratio, but it really helps add when you can put that hoochie skirt on there. So super successful rigging, very simple and effective, slides up and down your line, very awesome. And a quick tip to this, put another bear swivel about a, a foot up the line. You can make these essentially into leaders. From that, you can then have a set little baggie or two of maybe four or five rigs total. This way, as a beach fisherman, you have all your stuff with you in your pocket or your vest or your waders, whatever it may be. That way, if you're right in the midst of a hot and heavy bite, you break off on the bottom or whatever may be the case. You don't have to run all the way back up to the beach to go get your gear. You literally just go tie it on right out quick. It's already rigged and ready, so you're only tying one knot. It is such an effective way to have more time in the water, which means more fish for you. So hope you enjoyed this Tech Tip Tuesday, a quick one. But pink salmon are here, one of my favorite times. You can go catch some awesome fish like this. If you want to see more on how to do this, check out this video right here. All right, guys, you take care, and we'll catch you on the water real soon with a lot more videos on the way. Take care, and tight lines as always, fish on!